Hi guys, just wanted to uh, give you all an update. I haven't done a video for a little while, so I thought it'd be time to give you guys an update on what's been happening lately. So obviously you can see we did a new little display here. We put everything off the wall and into the cabinets. So I got the cooling and everything built in. A um, few things, we put a canvas oil pump system in here. So as the speed increases, your, your oil pressure is able to increase. Don't really need it here on the display. We don't run it for very long here. Um, purpose of this video today is to do some sound levels for you. Um, we've had some people come here and say it's awfully quiet, but it's kind of hard to let you guys online see what it's all about. So hopefully this will give you a little idea compared to a fuel engine. So what we'll do is I'll walk it through a couple of different um, RPMs and, and give you guys a reading at each, each level. So. To get started, we'll start out around, uh, let's do a baseline actually, that's probably a good thing to start with. Nobody's talking. Yep, 47 or so. We've got a helicopter going over us. So let's take it up to uh, 600 RPM to get started here. There's 600 right on the button. We are at 69, looks like. Sixty-nine. Okay, that would be going through a marina around seven knots or so. You probably wouldn't even hear it. We'll to go up to uh, twelve hundred. Let's double it. There's uh, twelve ten. I hope you can see that. Should be able to, it's around 71 or so. 71. Take it up to 1500. <clears throat> 73. Take it to 2000. Seventy-six and a half. Twenty-five hundred. This would probably be around a cruising speed somewhere in here. Eighty. Three thousand. Eighty-two. Let's go to top speed, thirty-seven hundred RPM. Eighty-six, eighty-seven. If this was a fuel engine. There's no way I could even probably wouldn't be able to talk to you on the on the video. So that kind of gives you an idea what we've been working on here and we've been trying to work with batteries, right? That's our biggest hurdle right now is the batteries, the pricing. Um, when we first started doing this, batteries are right around $1,000 a kilowatt. Now they're tucking up underneath 200. So uh, things are going obviously in the right direction. Um, we got a new controller delivered today. I got it, uh, Hydronautica. They gave us a controller to try out on here, so it's actually nice and smooth, actually. So we'll give that a try. They also have um, actually a neat little remote. We'll have to give that a try and see what that does. The magnetic base, it just sticks there, so that's kind of neat. So we'll get that hooked up probably on our next video. You'll see that sitting on here, and we'll be able to use it as a normal boat. Um, Anyways, yeah, that's my update. I just, I'll probably try and post a few more of these 
sooner so we're not waiting uh, so long in between my videos. Um, I should keep you guys more posted. By the way, we did become uh, an e-propulsion distributor. So a little outboard motors and stuff, we're gonna start handling those here at Ocean Air. So we're looking forward to that. But other than that, thank you for watching and stay tuned.